course, everyone's first thought was, where am I gonna play? Yo, what is up, guys? This is Beast for Gaming. Now that you committed to another year, coach must have a plan for you, you and Tommy on this. What position you'll be playing? I want to be wide receiver, but I want to be running back. I guess I'm gonna switch. Why? You want to switch and play? Figure Tommy switching positions for me in high school. I could do the same for him in college. That's not really how it went through my head. That's quite a change. Whose game would you say you mirror? Uh, elusiveness would be nice, but like speed, probably speed for Christian McCaffrey. I feel like my game is closest to Christian McCaffrey. Hit the outside quick and turn on the Jets so I can speed into the end zone. All right. Well, if you guys have missed the last episode, this is probably making zero to no sense. Everyone back has a special or go-to move. Catch anything, make them missed, or make them miss. Make them miss. It's all about breaking some ankles and shifting past defenders out there. Nothing sweeter than walking in for an easy TD. Yep. All right. So again, if you guys missed the last episode, this is gonna make zero sense to you guys. It felt good telling everyone I was sticking around and Tommy and I were gonna play together. The next question was, did it actually work out? Did it work out? Fantastic turn of events for Coach O'Brien's program. I mean, the defensive pantry has been pretty much left dry with most of that elite unit having bolted for the NFL. But today, Coach O'Brien revealed a new strategy, and I think it's kind of brilliant. Get both heartbreak kids on the field at the same time. I mean, it's really a brilliant move. Here's the deal. You got to get all of your talented players on the field at once, certainly if they're going to rely on the offense for a change to be the strength of this team if they're planning on making another run at it. So as I've been trying to say for like this entire episode so far, if you guys missed the last episode, this is going to make zero sense. We won the national championship after Tommy went down with his heart problems. We had to fill in for him. Before Tommy came back from the hospital, Coach O'Brien stopped by saying that Tommy's going to get the starting job. And he basically left us with two options. We can either go into the NFL draft or we can stay around for another year, but we have to switch positions. What is this? And uh, we just because we had already made a promise to Tommy at the hospital that we would stay around another season, right, we decided to switch positions. Am I able to change my number at all? Like I don't like the number sixteen. I want to. I want to be forty-four. After the snap, players can avoid defenders by performing skill moves. Okay, I know how to. All right, stiff arm. I, I have no idea. Actually, hold X. You stiff arm. Okay. There we go. Okay, I actually had no idea how to stiff arm. Protect the ball. I did it. Hey, I did it. What do you mean? I did it. Oh, I want to protect the ball as you score. I, I held it. I'm holding down R1. I was literally holding down R1 for the longest time. I didn't score. So it's because I didn't score, really? Really, dude? Really? Oh my god, this is gonna suck. I did it. There we go, finally. It literally won't let me hurdle. You're kidding me. It literally won't let me hurdle. Oh my god. Well, running, make a cut and hit them. Okay. Okay. What? I, I move, make a cut, and hit while you are cutting. I literally did that. I quite literally did that. I quite literally, I quite literally did what it told me to do. We might be in for a long season. Lo You're kidding me. I was doing everything it told me to do, and it wasn't doing it. It's like MLB The Show all over again. I'm trying to locate a pitch. I get perfect release timing, and it doesn't go where it's supposed to. I gotta say, I was surprised with the way you guys played that season, and especially considering you switched positions. Plus, Coach O'Brien really came into his own, leading you guys to the verge of the playoff. 
What 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 is this now? What is this now? Best college game this Saturday is here in Miami. So we're facing Miami. Hard Rock Stadium. Young. Who is young? Regular season senior year. Who is the? Who is this young guy? He's not the QB. Where's Tommy? Where's Tommy at? Better be able to super sim. I'm not playing this entire game. You can super sim. Thank God. Cause uh, wait, where am I? Hold up. Where am I on the field? No, no, no. Um, no, I. I I am the running back here. Where am I? Where am I on this field? Where am I? I'm not playing as Tommy. I'm not playing as Tommy. You cannot do this to me. Donde esta am I? Why am I on the bench? Can someone explain to me why I'm on the bench? Have I not played a snap all season? Oh, now you have me on the field. Why am I just coming out of the field now? Okay, well, we... And now you put now that I run the ball you put 20 back on the field. What what was that? What was that? Come on, man. I should have picked wide receiver. I thought it was going to have us only play as like as ourselves and so I wanted to get more plays, but I should have picked wide receiver. I was dumb to pick running back. Oh, cuz then I'd be in every play and Tommy could just pass to me. But halfback slip screen. Okay, you're still not going to put me on the field. What is this? What is this game that you're playing? What is this? Why why are you torturing me like this? Thomas has gotten all of the touches. Is this purposefully happening? Is there a reason for this? Cuz I have I've I've seen the field once. There we go. The second time I've seen the field and we're at the 1 yard line. Do I get my first touchdown? We do. There we go. Finally, it wasn't anything special. It was a one-yard touchdown, but I'll take it. it. Truly, okay. See, now I'm on the field again. We get, we get two touchdowns, six yards. Care, I, I really don't get it. I really, truly do not get it. I was on the field for six seconds. There has to be an underlying reason for that. They can't possibly say that. Oh, you had an amazing season. I barely saw the field. making the rounds and that's the heartbreak kids and their indelible bond once again taking college football center stage at the championship game later on tonight it has been truly amazing and truly inspirational to watch this amazing journey that these kids have been on from start to finish to this point showing off their character their grit their determination their heart has been on full display for all of us to behold and I normally don't say this but I for one will be a heartbreak kid in spirit as they take the field in this big game tonight. I, some big better happen. You better not just do the same thing you just pulled before. I'm not getting three carries. <sighs> this is this is gonna be aggravating if it's the same thing before. At least give me a cutscene. Give me a cutscene of some on-field action. I should have picked wide receiver. Why was what was I thinking? Thank you. Thank you for actually putting me in. Let's go. And first play. I stay up. Oh. All right. See, this is... Why was I not on the field before? What What was the point of this? And now Thomas... And now Thomas is back on the field after that play. You are kidding me. You are kidding me. I'm getting benched for this bozo. Come on, man. Come on, stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up, stay We lost three yards. We lost three yards. Don't take me out again. You took me out again. Why am I alternating snaps with Thomas? This was not the agreement. This in no way, shape, or form was the agreement. And I can't I can't edit the depth chart, can I? No. So why is why am I not seeing the field? Why? 
Come on, stay up. Stay up. Stay up. Stay up. Let's go. He breaks all these tackles. He breaks all these tackles. Why have you taken me out of the game for so long? He breaks for a long touchdown. You cannot be serious in saying that I'm your bench running back. You cannot be serious. Let's go. They're keeping me in. They're keeping me in. Let's break away for another one. Come on. Come on. Ooh. Nope. You are not taking me down. Okay. Maybe he's taking me down. Please tell me something happens at halftime. There we go. I'm seeing the field now. Please tell me something happens at halftime where I, like, have to go back in at QB because Tommy's hurt again or something like that because if this is just another you're just another game because let's be honest they haven't really switched up it's been a ton of gameplay which is better than like the long shot stuff where it was a ton of cutscenes. but like i i need some actual parts of the story here he caught that holy crap wait i'm just realizing something do we have to click on plays where it has like the icon for me to go on the field like look read option that is an icon Otherwise, does it not? Oh, halfback stretch. Am I going to be on the field? Oh, okay. I'm just been an idiot this entire time. This is why I haven't been on the field. I haven't been choosing the right plays. That's why I'm just an idiot. There we go, man. There we go. Hit that wide open hole and slide into home for a touchdown. I know I was combining baseball and football there, but dude, now I'm just so happy that I'm getting touches. Because now I can truly say that I got reps. Because that was really, really aggravating that I wasn't getting reps. It's your boy, Nick Keller. Come on, man. Score another touchdown. He breaks in the wide open hole, and there you go. That's what happens when you get those wide open holes. Yes, baby. This is our senior year. This is our senior year. You cannot take this away from me. 56 seconds. Senior year national championship game. Can we can we get a repeat? Can we get a repeat? Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's get it. Let's go. 63-21. Oklahoma Sooners. And I believe, ladies and gentlemen, that will be the last touchdown of Nick Keller's college football career. For the first time since 2000, the Oklahoma Sooners are the national champions. Is there is there not going to be an actual cutscene? Like... This is just going to be your standard trophy holding ceremony. Draft stock trending up. Let's go. Tommy is there this time. Let's get it, ladies and gentlemen. We repeat last year. How much you want to bet Tommy's going to say that was all him? So what is up next in the career of Nick Keller? And I, I guess Tommy Matthews will include him too. What is up next in their story? Let's find out. You know, it was really great what you did. What do you mean? I know you could have gone to the draft last year, but instead you risked everything to come back here and, and help us. It means a lot to me, man. Hey, we've been through it all together, man. You know I love you like a brother. So, are you feeling thankful enough to finally admit that I'm Batman? <laughs> Come on, let's not get carried away now. But hey, I will admit, we know Robin. Okay, <laughs> well at least there's that. Superman. Soups. Oh yeah. Okay, I can work with that. Yeah, you know he's Batman's equal, his biggest rival. And even though they battle it out from time to time, they always wind up back as close friends. I can definitely work with that. <laughs> But hey, just in case you ever go stepping out of line, you should know that I always keep an extra thing of kryptonite on me at all times. What? You might need that in the NFL <laughs> against me. No cap. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh boy. Oh, okay, I thought something bad was about to go down. Well, that was certainly a college career for the ages. Yes, it was. And, uh, it was my honor to be there with you guys through that part of your journey. And I just want to thank you for taking us through that. Now, we're closing in on another critical chapter. Ooh. The NFL Combine. The NFL Combine. Ooh. So, the NFL Combine. <laughs> I spent so much time preparing for it. 
Some things you can't ever say you're fully ready for. That's how Ooh. it felt to me. Some reports are saying are suggesting you may switch back to correct. Uh, shift back to QB. Oh yeah, shift back to QB. Definitely. I had a great experience switching roles to help the team out, but the whole time I felt the call to return to my natural role as QB, so that's where I'm planning to play in the NFL. Yup. Okay, thankfully we were able to go back. As you step out onto the field for the first time, a lot of teams will be watching. Do you hope a specific team drafts you? Ooh. Do we pick our favorite team or do we let fate decide? Okay, it's given us more time, so we got, we got, we were able to make some decisions. <sighs> Packers probably aren't going to pick us if we let fate decide, which would suck. But, oh, I want a force team pick. I want a four. oh, but that takes a fun away. We're going to sim pick. Honestly, it'd be an honor to be drafted by any team in the NFL. The only thing that matters to me is hearing my name called on draft day. Uh, I really, I really hope the Packers somehow end up picking us. I was feeling a buzz. <laughs> Said a lot of things. Will my performance back it up? Oh, am I allowed to change my number at any point? I really want to get rid of that 16. This cannot be happening. What am I? What am I missing? What happened? What's going on? Where was the last place you looked at him? If you knew where you last saw him, they wouldn't be lost now, would they? Yeah, thanks. Gotta help you are. <laughs> you, you're rich. Say it with me now. Eisen. Right, Eisen. You're rich, Eisen. Big fan. <laughs> I'm gonna be the laughing stock of your next broadcast, aren't I? It depends. You gonna run the 40 barefoot? I may have a little fun with you, but don't worry. I won't make you a running joke, huh? Ha ha ha. I thought it was pretty good. <laughs> where are. Where, where, so we're missing our shoes? But I'll tell you what. You let me wear your cleats? I'll laugh at any joke you have. I'm serious, I'm desperate. Try them on? Are you si Why is Rich Eisen wearing cleats? Hold up. Why is Rich Eisen wearing cleats? What's the verdict? Um, perfect fit, but honestly, and uh, I don't mean to sound ungrateful, but they're a little damp. They're like really damp. Did you go swimming in these? Thought you said you were a fan. If you were, then you'd know I just ran my annual Run Rich Run 40 for charity. That's his sweat. Right, right, right. I had to go. Let's just say my days of keeping up with Saquon Barkley are behind me. Maybe you'll fare better than I did out there. What was your time? 5.98, baby. <laughs> well, I can't do any worse. I've seen statues move faster than that. Uh. All right, well, I want you to go out there and post a time of at least 4.6. Think you can see Ooh. I'll do even better. With as much adrenaline as I have coursing through my veins right now from trying to find my cleats, there's no way I don't beat the combine record. Oh shoot! I can't. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. Just watch. <laughs> I shouldn't have said that. Here, you're gonna be helping those kids at St. Jude more than you know. Go get them, champ. Oh. Shoes bring you good luck and an even better. Shoot! 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 Thanks again, man. Yeah, I feel it. I shouldn't have said I'll do even better. I didn't think he'd say he's gonna break the combine record. Welcome to another exciting edition of the NFL Scouting Comp. I'm Rich Eisen, and I'll be your tour guide as we meet the next crop of elite NFL talent. We're gonna start things off with my personal favorite, the event that can break the spirit of any man. The 40 yard dash. What do I need to do? Do I need to like hit buttons? What do I need to do? How do I do this? Okay, 4.46. Oh dang, we are fast. Okay, so we gotta be. Okay, so this is how they're gonna do it. Okay.
Oh, is it gonna be the same buttons? Oh, it's the same buttons. 4.46. Same same one as last time. So draft stock trending up. Okay. What is this now? Oh, many NFL scouting combine. Because of your very limited experience, okay, don't have a ton of film on you, so they're very interested to see how well that you can throw a football. If you perform well, you could be drafted early. If you show you, you might slip to the way around. Okay, so this is important. Slant, throw to the hot spot. Receivers must catch the ball with both feet inside the hot spot. We gotta remember that. Okay. Let's go. All right. I I'm assuming these are gonna get uh, these are gonna get harder as we go on. All right, there we go. Let's. Ooh, the out route. Shoot. All right, there we go. We're, we're making good progress. We're making good progress. Ooh, this is gonna be tough. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. Oh, that worked. Did not think that would work. Wait, what? Why didn't it work? He caught it with it. Why did he turn up the field like that? Okay, I don't know what just happened, but we should have six out of ten right now. Okay, our draft stock's trending up. That's good. There we go. We're, we're, in, we're going on good notes here. Come on, get it in there. Get it in there. Let's get it, man. Draft stock trending up. That's what I like to see. Come on. As one of the top picks in the upcoming NFL draft. Please don't tell me the draft's next. Please don't tell me the draft's next. I'm not gonna be able, I'm not gonna be able to pause it. I'm not gonna be able to pause it. I'm gonna wanna keep playing. Please tell me something else is next. Please tell me we got like interviews or something. Welcome. Nope, it's the draft. We gotta pause it. I'm sorry, guys. I cannot do this. I want to do that in another specific episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode of Madden NFL 21 Face of the Franchise Mode here on the channel of the one and only BC Thick Bacon Beast Ray 4 Gaming. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure to give it a like and comment down below what you thought of today's episode. Make sure you guys go to the playlist section and click on the Madden NFL 21 Face of the Franchise playlist so you can keep watching these on repeat and make sure you guys stay up to date with this entire series because we will be doing this complete walkthrough on the channel. We are we are, we got so much more content to come. If you guys are liking again, make sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on those post notifications so you know when and what I am posting the freshest man NFL 21 content. And make sure you go down into the description and click on the links in the description before you head out to click on another video of mine and click on those links to the Elite Broke by lineup. We got Tanner, Noah and Logan all bringing you great content as we are the Broke Boy Clan. This is the Broke Boy Breakout. I'm telling you, you guys are not ready for anything we got coming. Make sure you subscribe to everyone. And I will let you guys know with those post notifications when I got a new video coming out. Thank you guys so much for watching. And this is Beast Ray 4 Gaming signing out of today's Madden NFL 21 video.